Hey guys, it's me again, and today, today is my 15th birthday. So yeah, so yeah, today I'm going to be showing you all the stuff I got for my 15th birthday today. So yeah. So yeah, and I got a lot of stuff, as you can see, for my 15th birthday today. So yeah. So yeah. So yeah, I got some Funko Pops, I got other things there, I got some two things, and I got some other things there. So yeah. So, yeah, but without further ado, let's get started. So, yeah, so I'm going to be starting with this. So, yeah, so, yeah, so, okay, first up, I got a PlayStation 4 game, and that's um, Ratchet and Clank. So, yeah, so, yeah, and, um, yeah, I just um, played this game. I just played a little bit of it, but I'm uh, quite stuck on it. So, yeah, so, yeah, but, um, 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 maybe tomorrow I might, um, I might look up a YouTube video, and I might, um, um, see how you do it. So yeah, see, I was really sucking it earlier, but tomorrow I'll look up a YouTube video, see how you do it. So yeah, but I have to say, um, when I first played this, I thought it was a really good game. The effects were really good. Ratchet and Clank were very good in it. See, so yeah, I was Clank and then I was Ratchet. See, so yeah, which was pretty cool. See, so yeah, see, so yeah, this is a really good game. See, so yeah, see, so yeah, this is a game you can beat. See, so yeah, see, so yeah, and I really liked it. The effects were really good on it. See, so yeah, see, so yeah, this is part of the PlayStation hits and it says only... On PlayStation, so yeah, so yeah, it's rated really seven and produced by Insomniac Games. So yeah, so yeah, here's the front. You got Ratchet, Clank, and Captain Cork, and I don't know the others, the other characters' names. So yeah, so yeah, there was also a 2016 movie of of this, which I did see, and I thought that was um a pretty good movie in my opinion. So yeah, so I saw it on cinemas back in May 2016. And I thought that was a pretty good movie in my opinion. So yeah. See, I see up anywhere. Here's a front. Here's a spine. Actually, like the design of the spine, actually. So, yeah. And here's a back here. And it says Action Gadgets Weird Aliens. And so, join one of the galaxy's greatest double acts in a brand new game that reta retells the airline charge tale of how they first came together, whatever you're a long time fan or new to the series, get ready for an action filled gadget fueled ride as Ratchet and Clank's origin story is reborn on the PS4. So yeah. So yeah. So yeah, it's very seven and contains violence. So yeah, it's a blurry disc as you can see. So yeah. So yeah. And that's just something inside, so yeah. So and here you got the leaflet, it's just about the Doffer controls, as you can see, so yeah. There's a the back there, just an ad for other um, PlayStation 4 games there, so yeah. And there's something there, so yeah. So yeah, and here's a disc here, and I really like the design of this. This has Ratchet on it, which is cool. So yeah, Ratchet is a long back, so as you can see, and Clank is a robot. I don't know what Captain Cork is. And this is a Blu-ray disc, as you can see. So, yeah. So, I like this artwork. It has a picture of Ratchet on it, which is pretty nice. So, yeah. It's Ray 7, as you can see. So, yeah. So, yeah, and here's the disc here. So, yeah. And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see. So, yeah. So yeah, so yeah, Ratchet and Clank, um, yeah, I'm happy I got this for my birthday. So yeah, so yeah, this is a um, really good game um, so far. I like this game. So yeah. Okay, so that's the PlayStation 4 game I got. So I only got one PlayStation 4 game. So yeah. So yeah, and then next up I got um three DVDs and a Blu-ray. So yeah, so I'm gonna start with the DVDs first. So yeah. So okay, the first DVD I got was um Tree Film Collection includes Bill and Ted Face the Music, Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey, and Bill and Ted's Excellent Venture. So now I'm not sure if this will work because I think this is from the US. But it says it's reduced in every region, I heard. So yeah, when I got this for my birthday. So yeah. 
So yeah, and I heard this is produced in every region. So yeah, so yeah, I will do the open to the slider anyway. So yeah, and we'll see if it works or not. So yeah, if it doesn't, that doesn't matter. If it does, that's great. So yeah. So yeah, so this is from the US, yeah. So and I haven't seen any of these three movies. I want to see them, so that's why I got this for my birthday. So yeah. So yeah, this, um, they both star Keanu Reeves, and I don't know the other actor's name. So yeah. So yeah, and I haven't seen any of these three movies, but I um, will give them a watch at some stage if, if this DVD works now. So yeah. So yeah. So yeah, Bill's Head Face the Music is the newest one. It came out last year in September. So yeah. So yeah, but anyway, here's a front, here's a spine, and here's a back here. True film collection, so it's, yeah. So yeah, okay. So yeah, okay, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure is on for 90 minutes, Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey is on for 94 minutes, and Bill and Ted Face the Music is on for 92 minutes. A Bill and Ted Face the Music is rated PG-13 for some language. Parents strongly cautioned some material may be inappropriate for children under 13. Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey and Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure are both rated PG and it says parental guidance suggested. So yeah. And the special features include audio and subtitles may vary. Special features not rated and may not be closed captioned or SDH. Okay, so it comes like this, yeah. So yeah, okay, here's the disc for Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, and I really like the song where it has a picture of Bill and Ted there, so yeah. And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see, so yeah. Okay, that's Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. And here's Bill and Ted's um, Bogus Journey, which has no artwork, it's just a boring orange disc, as you can see, so yeah. And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see, so yeah. And here's the last one, Bill and Ted Face the Music, so yeah, which is just no artwork on it, it's just a boring purple disc, so yeah. And disc is in really good condition, as you can see, so yeah. Okay, that's the Bill and Ted Tree Film Collection. So yeah, I haven't seen any of these three movies, but if this DVD works, I will give them a watch. So yeah. So yeah, okay, and I'm happy I got this for my birthday as well. So yeah. So yeah, okay, that's the first DVD I got. So yeah. Okay, and the next DVD I got was, this is one of my most wanted birthday presents for this year, and it was, and it is, um, the Tree Flavors Cornetto Trilogy. So yeah, and it, and it stars, they all star Simon Pegg and Nick Frost, Nick and Nick Frost. So yeah, they're all directed, the three of them are directed by Edgar Wright. So yeah, if you don't know Edgar Wright, he also directed Scott Pilgrim vs. The World and Baby Driver. I haven't seen Baby Driver, but I'm not interested in that. I just know Edgar Wright directed that. So yeah, and Simon Pegg is also in some other films and Nick Frost as well, I'm not going to mention them. So yeah, the, and, the, and, and the film's names are Shaun of the Dead, Hot Fuzz, and The World's End. See, I've only seen Shaun of the Dead and Hot Fuzz. I haven't seen The World's End yet, but I will watch it next week sometime when I'm off. So yeah. So yeah, Shaun of the Dead and Hot Fuzz are really good films, so I'm hoping The World's End is as good as them. So yeah. So yeah, but anyway, it's 15. Here's a front. So I like this box. Nice. Yeah. Here's the spine. Here's the other spine. Here's top. I like that. Such nice. Here's the bottom. And here's the back here. It says the Tree Flavors Cornetto Trilogy. So yeah. It's okay. okay, the bonus features on Shaun of the Dead include deleted scenes, feature ads, audio commentary, much more. Yeah. Okay, the bonus features on Hot Fuzz includes outtakes, feature ads, audio commentary, and much more. So yeah, the bonus features on The World's End include completing the Golden Mile and the making of The World's End deleted scene outtakes, trailers, commentary with Edgar Wright and Simon Pegg, VFX breakdown photo galleries and triva, tri, trivia track. So yeah. So yeah, okay, Shaun of the Dead is on for 135 minutes and the bonus run time is 156 minutes. Hot Fuzz is on for 156 minutes and the bonus run time is 19 minutes. And The World's End is on for 144 minutes and the bonus run time is 
one hour and 15 minutes. Answer 50 contains very strong language, strong sex references, and comic bloody violence. Suit for only first of 15 years and over, not finished by 10 plus for the age. So yeah, guys, and just to let you know, I'm 15 now. See, I'm not 14 anymore, I'm 15. I just turned 15 today, today's my 15th birthday. See, so yeah, it feels good being 15, so grown up, sip. So yeah, okay, um, here they are at the box here, so yeah. So okay, here's Shaun of the Dead here, so yeah. So and it says, a romantic comedy with zombies. So yeah. Adds 15, here's the front. Here's a spine. And here's a back here. And 15 contains strong comic violence and language. Future only press of 50 days and not by 10 press for the age. And here's a disc here, yeah. And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see, yeah. So okay, that's Shaun of the Dead, so yeah. And Shaun of the Dead's a really good film, so yeah. And the next one is, um, and the next one in the trilogy is Hot Fuzz, and this stars, um, Simon Pegg and Nick Frost, and it says from the producers of Shaun of the Dead. So yeah. So yeah, and it's 15, here's a front. Here's a spine. And here's a back here. And it's on for 1 hour and 56 minutes, and the bonus for the time is 21 minutes. And the bonus features include four audio commentaries, outtakes, theatrical trailers, and TV spots from Manu Could Be Fuzz, Hot Funk, Fuzz Omita, Storybirds, and Flick Book, The Other Side. So, yeah. As 50 contains very strong language and strong comic bloody violence, suit for only first of 15 years, not enough by 10 plus for the age. And here's a disc here, so yeah. And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see, so yeah. Okay, Hot Fuzz, and this is a really good film. Okay, that's Hot Fuzz, and this is a really good film. And the last one in the trilogy is... In the trilogy is... The World's End, and this stars, this stars Simon Pegg and Nick Frost. So yeah, this says pre prepare to get annihilated. Yeah, this is the only one I haven't seen out of the trilogy, but I will watch it next week sometime. So yeah, so I can't comment on it. So yeah, so yeah, it's 15, here's a front, here's a spine, and here's a back here. And what I've, from what I've heard, this um, one um, isn't supposed to be as good as the other two, but it's still meant to be good anyway. So yeah, so yeah, it says four stars Empire, four stars The Guardian, and four stars Total Film. And it's on for one hour and 44 minutes, and the bonus run time is one hour and 15 minutes. And it's 50 contains very strong language and strong sex references, so 20 plus or 15 years old, message by 20 plus for the age. And here's a disc here, so yeah. And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see, so yeah.
okay, that's the last one in the trilogy, and that's the world's end, and I haven't seen this film yet, so I can't comment on it, so yeah. So yeah, okay, that's the Three Flavors Cornetto trilogy, I'm very happy I got that, it's one of my most wanted presents for this year, so yeah. And the next DVD, and the last DVD I got was... Peter Rabbit 2, um, the sequel to the first Peter Rabbit movie. So yeah, so yeah, this is a really good film. This is one of my favourite movies of all time. So yeah, so that's not my favourite, you know what my favourite is. So yeah, so yeah this, but this is one of my favourite movies of all time. So yeah, so yeah. This one's just as good as the first one. I think the first one's really good, and this one's just as good as it. See, so yeah, I really like this. I saw this in cinemas um back in um back in June, and I thought it was just as good as the first one was. So yeah, see, so yeah, and you know, this is one of the this is this was the first film that I saw after um lockdown. See, so yeah, see, so yeah, and I was just so happy to go back to cinema after onward, that, and that was a whole year. See, so yeah, I was just so happy to go back to Peter Rabbit two in June. See, so yeah, and I got to see it in the cinema. See, so yeah, which was good. See, so yeah. And I will re watch this at some stage because it's one of my favorite movies. So, yeah. So, yeah, but anyway, to you, here's a front. Here's a spine. And here's a back here. And it includes crafts. Include, it includes create your own woodland, terrarium, and DIY buddy bookmarks and more. So, yeah. So, yeah, it's on for one hour and 30 minutes. And so you can take small comic fans, fair mouth, fair routine, university of all. And this is in an eco-friendly case, as you can see. So, yeah. And here's a disc here. So, yeah. And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see. So, yeah. This actually recently came out on DVD. It came out um, on August 2nd. So yeah, before my birthday. So I got it on my birthday. So yeah. So yeah, okay, that's Peter Rabbit 2. And this is one of my favourite movies. I love this film. So yeah. And I will do the opens all these um, DVDs um, and Blu-rays later. So yeah. So yeah, okay. Uh, okay, here's the last um, thing of movies that I got. And this is a Blu-ray that I got. So yeah, and it is... Um, Saving Private Ryan, and this stars Edward Burns, Matt Damon, and Tom Sizemore, and Tom Hanks as well. So yeah, so yeah, it's a Steven Spielberg film. It says five Academy Awards, including Best Director 1998, Steven Spielberg. So yeah, it's directed by Steven Spielberg as well. So yeah, so yeah, now you remember I used to have this on DVD, but then I, I, I got rid of it because it didn't have a disc in it because I got it for Christmas, but I got a Tom Hanks box of for Christmas and Saving Private Ryan came in it, but um, it didn't come with a disc. So yeah. So yeah, so I just had to get it again, but I got it on Blu-ray instead. So yeah, and I haven't seen this movie yet, so I will give it a watch at some stage, so I can't comment on it. So yeah, so yeah, it's 15, here's a front, here's a spine, and here's a back here. And it's on for 169 minutes, and it's 50 contains strong language and bloody violence, suit 21st of 15 years, and I'm not used by 21st for the age. This is an eco-friendly case as, as well as you can see, so yeah. And here's a disc um, here, so yeah. 
And the disc is in really good condition, as you can see. So yeah. Okay, that's Saving Private Ryan. See, and I'm very happy I got this in Blu-ray, and um, I will get this a watch at some stage. I haven't seen this film, so I can't comment on it. So, yeah. Okay, that's all the movie stuff I got. So, yeah. See, so, and now next to my Funko Pops, what I got. So, yeah. See, so, yeah, okay, the first two Funko Pops I got were... Um, Scott Pilgrim and Ramona. Now, these aren't really Funko Pops. They're different kind of Funko Pops. So, yeah, they have um kind of cartoony eyes so yeah which is pretty cool so yeah so yeah and scott pilgrim he looks really cool he could turn his head as you can see so yeah that's pretty cool his big head is big as you can see and his hair is big as well so he has sword in his hands yeah and his clothes so yeah so now i was meant to get these for christmas but they never came so i had to order them again and they came for my and i got them for my birthday instead so yeah which is good so yeah i'm so happy to get them so yeah he this one's really cool scott pilgrim one so yeah i love it so yeah So yeah, Scott Pilgrim's pretty cool. So yeah. So yeah, okay, and here's um, Ramona Flowers here. So yeah, she looks pretty cool. She has her eyes closed and she's got pink hair there. So yeah. She looks pretty cute. So yeah, I like her. So yeah. So yeah, okay, that's Ramona Flowers. So yeah. So yeah, okay, they're, they're the two Scott, two Scott Pilgrim, them different kind of Funko Pops. So yeah, I really like them. They're really cool. So yeah, I love them together. So yeah, they're cool. So yeah. So okay, the next one I got was a real Funko Pop. And I got a Dustin Henderson from Stranger Things Funko Pop. So yeah, he's really cool looking. He's got his hat and stuff on him. So yeah, I like him. So yeah, he's real cool looking. So yeah. I did order a Lucas one, but it'll come next week. So yeah. And I ordered... um some Scott Pilgrim t-shirts, but they'll come soon, so yeah. So yeah, it's the Dustin Funko Pops, so yeah. So yeah, it looks pretty cool, so yeah. So yeah, okay, it's Dustin, so yeah. So yeah, okay, they're, they're all the Funko Pops I got, so yeah. So yeah, okay, and now this was, this was my favorite present. This was one of my most wanted presents for this year. So yeah, and it is an iPhone 11. So yeah, and I'm using it to record the video at the minute, so um, um, I don't have it. So yeah, so yeah, so I won't bother doing a video of uh, me showing it. So yeah. So yeah, I'll just show, um, you know, what it looks like. So yeah, so yeah, this is what it looks like. So yeah, it's red. So yeah, which is pretty nice. So yeah, I really like it. I'm using it at the minute. It's really good. So yeah, so yeah, I really like it. So yeah, it's a box for it. I still have it. So yeah, so here it is. So yeah. And there's not much in here, it's just boring old stuff, so yeah. So yeah, it's pretty cool, so yeah. Then I've got all my normal apps on it, and I've got my backup for my old phone, so yeah. I got rid of my old phone, and I sold it so I could get an iPhone 11, so yeah. So I'm going to be using this phone to record my videos from now on, so yeah. Okay, that's my iPhone 11, so yeah, and this was um, my, my, my favorite present, one of my most wanted presents for it, um, this year, so yeah. And the next thing I got was um, AirPods Pro, because um, my other one's broke, so yeah, I want, um, I'm not going to bother telling you what happened to them. So, yeah, I just don't feel like it. So, yeah, so, yeah, my other AirPods broke, so I got AirPods Pro, um, new ones, so, yeah. So, actually pretty cool, so, yeah. So, yeah, and here, here, here are the AirPods Pro. They're fully charged, as you can see, so, yeah. Here they are here, so, yeah. They're different to the normal AirPods, so, yeah. So, yeah, they're really good now. I, I've i been using them on my new phone, and they're really, really excellent. So, yeah, I really love them, so, yeah. See any of my name on it as well. See how cool, yeah. Okay, that's my AirPods Pro. See, and I really love these. Yeah, they're really good. So, yeah. So, okay, and um, last up, I got um, 
two hoodies and a t-shirt so yeah first i'm gonna show you the t-shirt that i got so yeah so yeah now i've been at a summer camp um lately so, yeah, so that's why i have been making as many videos as i used to be see i've been doing some cast videos but um i haven't been doing that many because i've been at a summer camp so yeah so this is one of the things i got at the summer camp for my birthday today so yeah, and it is a a stranger things um i still still haven't took the tag off it but i'll take it off tomorrow when i wear it so yeah so yeah and this is a stranger things t-shirt i have two others so yeah but this is a str another stranger things t-shirt this time the logo is green and it has 11 on it so yeah which and this is really good i like this t-shirt so yeah, it's really cool so yeah so i was really happy to get it so yeah so yeah, i love it so yeah it's a really cool t-shirt i love it so yeah 11 really good on it so yeah green look so yeah so yeah, I can ask my Stranger Things t-shirt, so yeah. So yeah, okay, and the next thing I got was a Stranger Things hoodie. So yeah, and it has all the kids riding on their bikes there, which is cool. So yeah, so yeah, this is really cool. Um, yeah, it's a really cool hoodie. So yeah, I really like it. So yeah, it's nice hoodie. So yeah, pretty cool. So yeah. So yeah, I can ask my Stranger Things hoodie. So yeah. So yeah, okay, in the last birthday present i got in the last hoodie that i got was this american hoodie it says pen sport and there's a an, an american logo on it so yeah and here it is here so yeah now i did get a scott pilgrim t-shirt but i'm wearing it and i will post a picture of my community um of my scott pilgrim t-shirt that i got so yeah and there's another logo on the back oh there it is um little pen sport logo there so yeah so yeah it's a really cool hoodie see so i like it see so yeah, and I'll have to try the other two on tomorrow. See so, yep. so, yeah, it's a really cool hoodie. See, so, yeah, I love it. See, so, yeah. See, so, yeah, okay, that's the last birthday present I got, and that's the last hoodie I got. See, so, yeah. See, so, yeah, okay, that's all I got for my um um fifteenth birthday this year. See, so, yeah, see, so, yeah, I hope you liked all the stuff I got. See, so, yeah. See, so, yeah, and I will do the open to all those things um later. Not the video game though. See, so, yeah, those things. See, so, yeah. So then I will post a picture by, on my community of um, my Scott Pilgrim t-shirt that I got. So yeah. Hope you enjoyed it. So yeah. So then I'm really happy with all, like, with all I got. So yeah. So yeah, guys. Thank you for watching my video. See you in my next video. And goodbye. Peace.